All right, gamers, we actually got some new news for Duncan. Of course, we have a whole bunch of brand new info, a whole bunch of brand new stuff. I'm going to go ahead and jump right in because we have a whole bunch of new info for Golden Week. We have the brand new units revealed for 2024. I'm going to go over them, talk about them, give my full thoughts and opinions though. So, yeah, of course, we got a new Goku, we got a new Gotenks, we got a new Evil Boo. We have a brand new Super Fat Boo. Um, There's a lot on here, honestly, of course. Thank you to Duncan Official, of course, for all the news. Um, but, yeah, let's go ahead and get started with Goku, though. So, yeah, I'm ready to jump right in. So, of course, he does. Uh, Majin Buu, so actually, I'm going to just zoom in a little bit more. Let me uh, zoom in. That should be a little bit better, honestly. Yeah, I think that's a little bit better, honestly. So, like I actually say. Um, so, he does. I'm going to just go in order because it doesn't matter to me. So, he does Majin Buu, or his little kill, Majin Buu Arc, Other World Warriors, with that category is kind of dead, honestly. It kind of sucks at this point. Or Accelerated Battle, Key 3, Outside 170, not bad for Little Scope. And all stats, of course, took all stats 30% for coming in hot and time limit. Not too bad, not too bad. Um, of course, his super attack effect. I love, I love the name of it. Instant transmission meteor crash. That sounds awesome. I've seen some of his animation to frames. They look good. Gorilla Ray's attack defensive for one turn. Immense damage. Hatch into stun. Uh, his passive. Um, buying time at all costs. That sounds awesome. Activates intro animation only once, but chance to perform a crit of 50% for five turns from the character's entry turn and reduce the damage received by 90% upon the character's um, entry. And with each turn passed, uh, damage reduction is minus 15% up to no up to max or I guess is more less than 90% when there's another Majibu category ally on the team upon the character's entry. Two key attack defense at 150 plus additional attack defense at 150 when performing a super attack reduces damage received by 5% with each super attack performed up to max of 30. Medium chance of performing a crit launches an additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack if there's another Majibu category. Um, a category ally attacking the same turn, which again, you want to build more boo team, uh, which honestly isn't too bad. The auto the restrictions I need to at this point. Plus, additional attack de a defense of 100%, um, and guards against all attack of the first attacker in the turn, plus additional attack up 100%, and launches additional super attack with the second or third attacker in the turn. Pretty much like Piccolo from last year, because he, if he was in the second or third slot, he gets like a little bit more attack. But in the first slot, he was, uh, I think, no, the second, it was the second slot. If there's like more attack, but in the first slot, I think he just focuses on dodging more or something like that. Very similar to last year. I would pickles are really good. Pickles are really, really good. And in a turn, high chance of it, a no fun key based, um, key boss super attacks and direct at the character and counter with tremendous power. Okay, so he counters and he nullifies. Okay, honestly, not too bad for Goku, honestly. Not too bad. I like, I like his kit. I'm like, eh, but I think overall he's gonna be really good. He has crit, uh, damage reduction, um, you know, Majin Buu support. Which is or pretty much based off Martian Blue Arc support, because the newsletter did say that. Uh, his, uh, his links are Golden Warrior, Super Saiyan, Saiyan, Saiyan Lineage, Over in the Flies, Lumen Breaking Form, Come on Me Hall, Fierce Battle. Um, his categories are. Oh, yeah, he, have, yeah, he has a full power coming Oh, cool, for his passive. Active. Can be activated when there's another Majin Buu or a category ally attacking the same turn. After five or more turns, um, uh, from the fr from the fourth turn, starting uh, from the start of battle only once. Um, his best is the effect for his active effect. Um, a massive raise the attack um, temporarily causes ultimate damage, and within the active and and within the turn activated, all attacks become crits. Okay, that's been the common thing though. His link, his categories are Majin Buu, um, Ma okay, Buu Saga. Um, other World Warriors, Celebrated Battle, Come on, all Time Limit, Resurrected Warriors, Super Saiyan 3, Pure Saiyans, Goku Family, Turtle School, Max Evolution, Bond of Friendship, Power uh, Power, uh, Power Beyond Super Saiyan, pa Bond Parent and Child, or Better Fighters. Um, not too bad, honestly, for Goku. He does a lot for what he can do. He does a lot. These Goku units always go all out, and I'm glad, though. Not too bad, though. I think he's pretty good, honestly, for what he can do and everything. Not too bad. Of course, on to Boo, he is next. Of course, Extreme Ant. Is he, is he tech? Okay, he's AGL, he's int. Really weird, but we do need more int units, honestly. That can help out a lot. So, of course, we have... For Boo, we have... <laughs> uh, Majin Buu Arc, Sworn Enemies, or Story Figures, Key 3, all sets of 170. Not bad, that, that, that's the that, decent move to go. And all sets 30% uh, all set 30 to Robot Chaos or Reserve to Warriors. His Super Tech Effect. To raise Defense... Greatly raises attack for one tournament's damage. Oh, even though attack defense, that's gonna be fun. I love using like that. Uh, let me see. His active activates intro animation and recovers 10% HP at the start of the, of the character's attacking turn. Makes sense, of course, for the rest of the battle. Makes sense. He always scores 10% HP plus additional 10% HP recovery for, for five turns from the character's entry turn. And there's another Majin Buu category, um, 
how high of a team, but it's like I said, they're basically a bunch of Buark teams, so that's good, though, because last year, I mean, again, I don't care about the restrictions, so that team can be... With the new, with the new, L, the new LRZ is coming to global, yeah, you bet they're gonna be good. <laughs> uh, upon the character's injury turn, entry, key to attack defense at 150, plus additional attack defense at 150, uh, when performing a super attack, launch an additional attack, that has a great chance of becoming a super attack. Guard gets all attacks when HP is when HP 50% or more at the start of a turn. Recover 10% HP at the end of a turn if HP is 30% or less at the start of a at the end of the turn. Recover 10% HP again. He just he's an HP sponge, which is good. Rives with fully HP recover. Okay, that's cool. Um, if it's KO'd, of course it's KO unit. That's he survives KOs, of course. Have, we haven't seen that gimmick since like Namek Goku, like almost 10 years ago at this point. Uh, up to once a, within a turn. So I guess he could do it multiple times in a turn, or I think it's just once up, because I think the wording for that's a different. I think he just puts up. Plus additional attack defense up. 100% guard against all attacks, a large digital super attack. Um, sorry from the turn with his character, our ally revives, uh, revival skill. <laughs> <laughs> He's activated. Flip recovers HP with sweet treats. With sweet treats, I guess they'll call it that now, with the Majibu candy from the Majibu event. Okay, not bad. Boost mainly more of an HP um, unit, so I don't mind that though, of course. I can help you in a lot of situations. He revives. Chris Gig get full HP. Yeah, he's HP. Yeah, he's crazy with HP though. Not bad though, honestly. I, I like how these uh, kits are built. That's about I get it both full because I'm Boo Arc stuff, so you get pretty much room on the same team. Um, Which I'm could do it anyway though. Um, his links are... Actually, his links are categories are over here. I can go over that in one. Uh, because it's activated as a candy beam. Cool. Uh, can be activated after the character is revived. From start from the seventh turn from the start battle only once. Master of the Riz attack, uh, causes ultimate damage and delays a single target attack for one turn. All keys first, uh, turn to cookies and for one turn, gets 12 key. Dang! Dang, boo! They get, they made him a healer? And they gave him, like, ultimate damage, they gave him healing, like, jeez Louise, man, you're not gonna lose health with God for a bit. Holy crap, with all the boot teams we got, Roger Power, and we got the new EZ coming out, oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. Uh, all the boot teams, honestly, they're really, really good, like, the boot arc team, this team, like, is some good stuff. Of course, links are Majin, the Innocence, Kalamiha, Infinite Regeneration, Revival, um, all standing tall, fierce battle. Categories are Majin Buu Arc, Sworn Enemy, Story Thinkers, Warlock Chaos, Resurrected Warriors, Transformation Builds, Time Travelers, uh, Artificial Life Force, Coming Me Hob, Buu, Majin Power, Power Absorption, Gifted Warriors, Legendary Existence, Powerful Comeback. So yeah, these guys are on a lot of categories, which can help them out a lot. That's the thing about categories. We're going to keep getting more on top of that as well. I know we haven't got a lot of new ones recently, which is good, though we don't need, I feel like fighting the game with them will be too much. But the, helping out these, that's the thing about these teams, they're, they're going to be helping out a lot of categories. Even though I like said the restricted margin will work, but you can probably blend a lot of that in together anyway. Of course, on the go tanks is the new side unit though, of course. Not too bad, not too bad. So he does Hyper Saiyan's key through outside the 130. Uh his super attack effect. Master is attacking defense up for one turn, supreme damage. Um passive. Attack defense up 100. Dang for a side unit, they're crazy. Holy crap. I mean I get it, I get it different for Golden Week, because your Grill and Tin are actually really good. Holy crap. Holy crap. We should begin the Dark Fest teasers in like the next few hours. And Data Dabo. Uh, cause you forget, it's both global JP, so it's gonna be at 3 in the morning, 3, 4, well, yeah, 4 o'clock, 3 o'clock in the morning, so, yeah, again, when the games sync up, it's pretty much gonna be like this, Doka Fest releasing at the same time, it's gonna be honestly, actually, when they sync up, are we gonna have this too, for global and JP, like, it's gonna be global, like, they're gonna tweet out the stuff like this with JP, I, honestly, I just thought about that too, they're gonna be tweeting out stuff at the same time, like, it's gonna be like this, like, Golden Week, it's gonna be English, then a full JP translation, then a full JP, then, like, full English, at the same time, honestly, that would save a lot of time. That's gonna be really good. Okay, um, I'm just thinking about stuff. I, I'm thinking about the sink, like, again, because we're almost there. It's crazy how much stuff. It, it's crazy. It's crazy. Because I'll be thinking, Tumbo's next, Freeze could be next for Global. I, I, I don't know, but it's, it's so much right now. It's crazy. Uh, attack defense up 177. Again, they're side unit. This is crazy. Attack defense up 177. A great chance of key going up by 7, plus additional. Uh, attack defense of 77 percent of course all sevens make sense when performing a super attack if that's goku is gonna be seven performing a super attack launch an additional I mean, they have a formal super attack anyway so it's really good though uh performing a super attack launch an additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack great chance of enemies attacks including super attack or seven turns from the character's entry turn and high chance of enemies attacks including super attack like, he, he dodges and gets a key so so from the eight turn from the start from the um Gird entry turn plus an additional attack defense up 77%. Seven, seven, seven 
It's like a third deck in the turn, plus a digital attack defense of 20%, up to max 77%. With each attack invaded, um, including super attacks, tends to form a crit up to 20%, up to 77%. When there's another super attack being performed. With each super attack performed. So I guess you want to go for additional, because the more super attacks he's get. So which, again, he probably already has that in his kit. But no, his kit, I mainly he dodges, though. Like, so you want to dodge with him, again, like, more super attacks for the crit to go up. Very different, though. Of course, his links are... Actually, do I have them up here? His links are categories. Yeah, okay, his links are categories. Yeah, same warrior race. His links are same warrior race. Same lineage. Innocent. Shocking speed. Fuse fire. Over in a flash. Fierce battle. He has over in a flash? Fierce battle. Normally, I feel like he's... I feel like he was meant to be a Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, because... Do the other base form Gotenks have over in a flash? I think they do. I didn't think about that, actually. That's really weird. Now that I think about it, honestly. That's crazy. I just thought about that actually. Huh. He has over in the flash. That's a good W, honestly. High race he has is a cat are high race is fusion, Roger Poo are youth, those are pose, rubber growth, connected hope, A, that rhymed. Um a gifted warriors, heavenly events, time limit, um, trusted wills, fuse fighters, earth better fighters. Um yeah, again, like I said, all these categories get buffs though, which is really good. They they can use some of the more help in general for the in the game in general. Like this cat, like I'm thinking about the categories it's gonna be helping out on. That's gonna be really good though. Again, he's not restricted to the Maji Borok team though, so he could probably run him on special pose with probably like, the new Yzeko thing that just came out on Global. So he could probably run him on their team too. I see that would be just disgusting together, honestly. Him and the Super Saiyan three. I thought about that. Holy crap, they're gonna be insane. I like these going to be units so far though. Watch the watch the boos gonna be like the worst of them. So yeah, pure evil boo. Kinda came out of nowhere, honestly. Kinda wasn't Oh yeah, okay, okay, yeah, because the types are based off their oh yeah, I guess he's tech. Boo's int. Yeah, he's tech. Yeah, boo is like int. Goku's AGL, go tanks is physical. Well Yeah, he's tech. Yeah, he's physical. Boo's int. He's tech. Goku's AGL. Just kinda thought about that though. Of course, his uh, passive does Maju, uh, his leader skill. Maju Power Q3 outside the 130, super attack effect. Massive Raise attack defense up for four, Massive Raise attack for four turns supreme damage, holy crap. Uh, I, think mass, I think that's like 70% or 50%, I can't remember. His passive is key one, attack defense up 40%, a chance of forming a crit and a chance of an enemy attack, including super attacks up 10% per Majin Buu category, per Majin, per Majin Power category ally on the team. And of all allies on, on the team, our Maja Power, which again, you want to run on there anyway, so it seems like he's restricted to that. Maja, additional super attack, and all attacks become crits, plus an additional... Okay, jeez louise, attack defense of 60% when forming a super attack, plus additional attack of 60%, if there's a... if HP 60% or more, which I don't think that's too hard. When attacking, recovers 5% HP at the start of a turn, uh, recovers additional 5% HP when HP um, is 80% or less. I don't care about the HP restriction, though, because you're going you're gonna to be high enough. At the start of a turn... Covers more than he recovers more and recovers more than 10% HP, which is 40% or less. It's sort of a turn, so if it's five scale attacks up to once, um, within a turn, that's a that's a tum turn. Um, when HP is 40% or more, high chance of a nullifying key based, um, key bot super attacks directed at the character and it counters with tremendous power recovery. HP is retreat. Okay, so he's okay, that's actually not too bad though, honestly. Um, Honestly, these units actually aren't too bad, though. Honestly, they have their own like little kits. Like this guy, pretty much is boost saga is Majin power support. Um, but he's pretty much focusing on, like go tanks where he dodges. There'll be um the kind of like the less a the more HP restrictions you go down, the uh, stronger he'll kind of get. He'll heal up more, which actually is pretty unique. Go tanks, I think, is pretty good as well. Though he just dodges a lot. Um, but you can build that towards the you can you keep building that up a lot. You can, if you give him full additional, you can be doing super attacks a lot. He's gonna be dodging a lot. He's gonna be critting a, a little bit, so that's gonna help him out a lot too. Um, boosting's really good as well, though. Um, like well, his healing is insane amount of healing. His yeah, pretty much his his, his, his insane amount of healing uh, is gonna be insane. And of course for Goku, he seems pretty good as well, honestly. Like, again, they're all based on restricted Majin Buu. I don't care. Who cares? Doesn't matter. But every time you pretty much, you know, you turn go by, or, you know, the more you're in the fight, you're gonna keep getting, you know, crits, super attacks, more little buffs just from being, like, on the Majin Buu arc team. Honestly, though, not too bad this year. Not too bad, honestly. Can't really complain. Can't really complain.
Like, I really got nothing else to go. Again, the Golden Week, these major celebration units are always usually crazy anyway. Um, but I'm not going to go complain about it probably too, too much, honestly. Because I think I see them, I can see, like, these guys being a lot of teams, a lot of category buffs, a lot of just, you know, stuff helping them out in the future. But honestly, though, they seem pretty good, like, what they're, like, what they're standing on. Because last year we had a lot of good units. This year we got a lot of good units, honestly. I'm very impressed. I think, I think they did pretty good, honestly. Before they could do it. They didn't, they don't overdo it. They didn't underdo it. This guy's gonna be the same with the new Go Tanks. This guy's gonna be crazy with margin power. This guy be, is gonna be crazy with his healing. This guy's gonna be crazy with his damage reduction, his counters. He counters too, though, by the way. He's a side unit. He counters. I always see the stick effects out. Actually, they'll be probably pretty decent. But yeah, we got another Goku, right? Super Saiyan 3, 3 Goku's back to back, which is gonna be good for that team anyway, because him, the new Super Dragon Fist Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Goku just got super easy. I was Super Saiyan 3 love, honestly, for Goku. I was real that too, but yeah, like. Go Tanks has got super easy air on JP. Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks. Yeah, I'll Super Saiyan 3 love, honestly. I just noticed that this year. Crazy. I might be thinking something else, though. Someone will comment and be like, Oh, Hyper, you know, you forgot um, Super Saiyan 3 Bardock. I'm just kidding. But yeah, see you guys later, though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Great love. I'll go to the kingdom. Enjoy your stay safe. Flash your hands. God bless all of you. If you go out, put in one match. Don't tell me about your rearings. You can back to if you can't go outside. This is what you copy him. Drop my friends in the dirt course. I'll never get aware. Guns are awesome. Wake up. Look at my Of course, I can hate it again. I like it all. I think it's all good, honestly, for what they can do. They all stand out on their own. They're all pretty, pretty good. But yeah. Um, yeah, though. See you guys there, though. We're going to go. It's out. Uh